On this exercise, you're gonna to need to start off with a little bit of a smaller ball, which I have between my feet. And then you're also gonna need a larger Swiss ball. And so if it's harder to do this on the Swiss ball, you could do it on a couch if you just wanna really hit the inner thighs. But for this exercise, I'm showing you on the Swiss ball. So what I'm gonna start off by doing is giving myself a little bit of a tuck here. I'm constantly holding the ball between my feet as I'm doing the entire exercise so it doesn't fall. So we can clench the ball in the, between the heels a little bit more. I'm in a bullfrog position. And what I mean by that is my knees are out, my heels are in, my feet are kind of turned out. And then what I'm gonna do is as I push my back flat a little bit into the mat by tucking that rib cage under, I'm gonna roll the ball towards me. Now, I'm still holding the ball between my feet so I'm feeling these inner thigh muscles kick in. And now I'm feeling a little bit more of my hamstring kick in as I roll it towards me. So as we come up, we're doing our little bit of a rib cage tuck here. We're rolling the ball towards us. And we're squeezing the ball between our heels. I'm feeling this in my abs, my inner thigh, and my hamstrings, and also in my shins because I am having to flex my foot. One more time. We're going to rib cage tuck. As we rib cage tuck, we're squeezing the ball between our heels, rolling the big ball towards us. We're feeling all this nice and good through the hamstring, the abs, the front of the shins, and then we're going to go ahead and relax. So you can see this from another point of view. I'm going to take this big ball away so you can see I have this little ball between my heels. You see my knees are pointed outwards. And then if I was to come and show you from this standpoint as well, I have my toes are out, balls between my feet, and then my knees are pointed outwards and I'm bringing it up and down, kind of doing like a bullfrog leg. 